Nate's got the front end flipping up real good. It's a lot lighter than I thought it was going to be, really. You can almost do it with one hand, actually. I was quite surprised. Nice. <coughs> I was quite nice. surprised. I had a great pair of pliers. And it didn't take that long, to be honest with you. Like, just get you to hold it in the middle, and I'll pull these pins. Hold it in the middle. You'll be able to hold the front, no problem. Just, just hold it up. Oh, that come out that easy? There. And if we grab the tubing on either side, you should be good to the grill. I get, I get the... Yeah, you're all right. Go easy. I mean, Go easy, he says. The, should be tipping up. I should pop right down. Oh, it's going. <laughs> Just a second. My tacks are letting go. Your tack letting go? I guess. That's a good tight hinge, brother. Roll the head just a little bit more. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Ah, I see. It. Let it pry Keep itself going. off. Keep going. Got a little bit of trimming to do there, but listen. You buy a hinge, you you get it off a lot quicker than that, if you know what I'm saying. Line up. Isn't it? Sure it is. Yeah, it'll be all right. Yeah, I just I have to scratch it up a little bit. So what happened there? Just pried on that bump stop or anything? That pried that off? Yeah, it just slid off the bump. I'm just going to shine that up a little bit. Cool. That'll be all right. Okay. So Nathan's going to cut the firewall out. We're going to, and we're going to end up building a thing to hold the engine. Just for now, just for now, we'll cut that much out and then we'll see after that. I don't want to take anything away from this structure here. Um, it looks whoever done it has done a pretty good job. Squared off and looks nice and strong. Yes, so yeah, you want to go down here or here on this one? Just go right up this line. Go straight this up. Line right here, yeah. Yeah, right up straight up there. Yeah, there. yeah. okay. I, I ain't got the line straight for you, have I? No, don't I, worry about I, that. I, I fooled you. Don't worry about that. I'm just saying here you want to come up right here though. Yeah. Yeah. That's what I was thinking. Okay. Yeah. And then we'll just build a different set of braces to this way on the frame. Just from there to there, tack to the body. Right. That way when it comes off it can... So, okay. okay. Nathan's figuring that out. If Jolene wants to come for a second. We've got... Um, we're, I'm working on this door and... Uh, what, is, what did I say the last video? You could probably put a couple hinges in within the day, which you could, <laughs> but you were nowhere near going to finish it. There's so much more work that I probably, um, yeah, just overlooked it as I got the hinges in them. Wow, that went easy. You could do a couple uh, hinges in the car. You could place them in there, get them tacked in there. You probably could do that no problem in a day whatsoever. But when it comes time to, f to, finish, to finish the door, um, that's where it's going to, it takes a little bit more time. I've got, I've got, I took and cut off Oh, let's hear stuff. If you can see on maybe the other side. Let's go to the other side. For a okay, 1960. Take that one. This stuff here. You can see how it's got a piece there coming down. It didn't look that good, you know. I just covered it over because it was a piece of the door. I covered it over and went with it. But in actual fact, I cut this off all on the other side. So it's just one piece all the way down. So we'll go over to the other side just for a second. Oh, the back and forth type of deal. Yeah, do si -do and the way we go. So I have, I just took the zip cut and cut that off. Now that comes down around smooth, much, much, much better. We'll weld that down along there all the way around our hinge, down our seam again on this here. Basically just made it all the way to the bottom. Gonna clean it all off so it would be in that one nice piece. Just thinks it, looks, th thinks it looks a little bit nicer. I think it does. It does look a lot nicer. We'll put a piece down this side for if we need to put something to it. Um, now I still have, and what I'm thinking is I still have, if you want to come take a look at the back of the door on this side, I still have this to do. Still going to make that up in there. Probably do that when the door comes off. Now, also, when you come up in the front here, I cut the hinges off. And what I did is I left the hinge right there. I cut the hinge off, left it there, put the, the weld on the bolt, the bolt set were in it, and then I just continued on, ground it off, made it flush it off, and there it got. Didn't make a piece, didn't do anything. Take this back inside, we'll sandblast it. That's nice and clean there, tight and right. Just 
just use the hinge piece. Now I've got this, you can see I'm doing the exact same thing with this hinge. I just left it there, cut it off. I'll, I'll grind in there a little bit, maybe feather it off, because it's got to get feathered off somewhere. And, and then grind it off, make it look nice. Got to deal with this down here. Got to make a piece for this down here. Got some body filler in there. Does not bother me. You know, one thing about body filler, it does not rust. Yeah, so I have a couple more places to, to deal with. Chad, more room for activities. I take the blanket off every day and take a look at it. I take the blanket off every day and take a look at it. Huh? I come up at night time and take a look at it. I've, I've, I've never had something like that before. Huh? You've had it for a day, how'd it feel? <laughs> yeah, I didn't even have, not even quite 24 hours. <laughs> what? I didn't even have it quite 24 hours, but I was at the shop looking at it too. Mm. Nate likes the, the wheeling and dealing. Yeah, wheeling and dealing's good. Yeah. Doesn't always have to be about money. And to be honest with you, it just, it just seemed right at the time, like when it, just you know, come up the, the, the opportunity, time, uh, come up. Like I, I did had no idea that uh, that engine existed. Nathan come up with a deal and then said, are you interested in that if I make the deal? Yeah, that's going to look so cool in that. That's going to be, I think it is the um, motor that should be in it, to be honest with you. It's the and hot, I feel way, like with the engine way back inside the, the cow. Okay. Want to yeah. race, Ross? Um, <laughs> yeah, I'm excited about this one. Take there off. Make some braces. 